I read the book Traction at the referral of a friend and I thought, this is great. Not only will this help me really grow the business, it will make the business more profitable and most importantly, give me back time. Time to do things that were important to me, my philanthropic efforts, hanging out on my boat, spending time with a wife. Whatever that time was, however you choose to spend it, I know you want more back as a business owner. Traction will get you there. EOS will get you there, and likely it will not get you there alone. I'm going to introduce you to my coach who helped us to implement EOS into our company quite successfully, John Ward. Good morning, Wally. John, first and foremost, thank you. You're welcome. So, we made the effort at Home Pro Inspections to self implement. I think we got pretty far on our own pretty quickly. Yes, you did. What did you see in us that, w that wasn't quite where it needed to be, that you were able to coach us back to get on the path to accelerate the business? Two things I remember. One, um, your accountability chart wasn't quite crisp enough. You didn't have all of the roles completely defined top to bottom. And as often happens, you were sitting in a few too many seats. Uh, once we got that clarified, you guys really embraced it right away and started living in, in your lane. Everybody staying in their roles and doing what they should be doing. Secondly, I recall that your rocks were not quite as um, specific as they needed to be. They weren't crisp and defined. And they weren't always the right ones. Um, you were hitting some softballs. When we got the right rocks in place and we defined them so that they were crystal clear what needed to be done, you started executing on those, and that's what made the biggest difference. Um, other than that, it was getting your level 10s to be a little more crisp, and those were all good. So, you know, my time with you was relatively short, and that's the beautiful thing about the way this works. This is designed so that we get you where you need to be, and then you're on your own. Um, well, you've uh, never left us alone. <laughs> <laughs> I reach out to you. Ryan reaches out to you. You're, you're, you're gone always, but not forgotten. It yeah, isn't, always ready to help. It, it's, 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 uh, that relationship continues. It's mm -hmm. continued here in Jacksonville. It's continued when we've done other things elsewhere around the country. So it isn't as though it's a one yes. and done. It, the That's relationship right. continues, and I, I know that. Uh, anytime I have a need, if we can solve it on the phone, it gets yep. solved. And if I need an hour, or I need a day, I know that you're ramped up and ready to go and, Always. and do those things with us. That's a great comfort for me. The, the person who's committed to self-implementation, make the compelling case of why it's a, it's a value add to get a a professional, those fresh eyes to come in and, and jumpstart the implementation, even if it's just to jumpstart it. So your first question to me is the best example of that because, and this, this is no fluff, Wally, I work with a lot of companies that have self-implemented. No one made it as far as you did on their own. So that's testimony to you and your career. Thank you. It's just different to make it to the finish line. Exactly. <laughs> we, we but, but again, <laughs> what we discovered when we started was there were some foundational pieces that you missed that you from the inside looking at what you're doing can't see what an outside implementer can see. So when I come in and I see that you haven't really properly defined that accountability chart and by changing that we get people focused on doing the right things, it makes an instant difference in the success of your business. When we get your rocks properly defined so you're focused on the right priorities every quarter and holding each other accountable makes a huge difference. Now I've worked with some other self-implementing companies where they thought they were doing everything right and they were essentially doing nothing right. And so we yeah. had to start over. Everybody's different. Excellent. Well, I want to give you a, a personal thank, thank you for the you, great Wally. things you've thank done you. to improve my company. And the great things you've done to improve my company has helped improve my life. So I'm very Wonderful. grateful for that. My I want to thank John and I cannot encourage you enough. If you've even got traction on the shelf and you haven't finished reading it yet, Get a hold of John, have a conversation with John. The journey will be faster, it will be simpler, and trust me on this, you're going to spend money, but you're going to spend the money, and you're going to see that return in time and dollars very rapidly. Mm -hmm.